The final race for me on day one will be the big books. Maiden, a two mile six furlong maiden hurdle. Uh, at the top we've got Dark and Tribulation for James Shea. Military Salute, Jim Murray, Control Freak. Graham Clutterbuck, Hot Springs Unknown, Vinny General, Jane Austin for David Robertson. Tekipi Complaining for <laughs> Derek Hinson and Tangled for oh, Martin Leadham. Here we'll sweep off the track. Called in and away. The smallest field of the day so far. This is my final race of day one. Gray will be doing the next three for you from Worcester. And Jane Austin is the early leader. With David Robertson as they make their way towards the first of 14 flights. And good jump by the leader, Jane Austin. She's now gone four clear. Off to Kippy complaining on the outside in second. Tangled down this near side is third. Now moving to second. As they head on towards the third, Jane Austin's the leader. For David Robertson, Tangled in second. And Control Freak and a military salute. Dark and Tribulation after that one. And then Hot Springs Unknown. And to Kippy complaining is the back marker. straight into that hurdle. Got away with it, they would have surrendered the lead and indeed second as well to Tangled and Military Salute. Tangled leads over the fourth. From Jane Austin who's come back into second again now. Control Freak is third. Then Military Salute fourth. To keep him complained on the outside of Dark and Tribulation and then finally Hot Springs Unknown. Just a back marker. Still the best part of two miles to race. And Tangled is in front. Being challenged again now by Jane Austin. Who's now come back through to just about show in front. Jumped that one better in fact than Tangled. And has now gone two lengths clear. And Jane Austin's in front. Tangled is in second. Control Freak is third. Then Military Salute. With Dark and Tribulation after that one. A leader again. Taking a chance with a hurdle. Jane Austin took a bit of a dive at that one. It's a tangle to get back within half a length in second. Control Freak is in third. And then Military Salute back in fourth. They're all still in this. A mile and a half still to go. This is flight number seven and the leader jumps it much better this time. They come up past the stand then. And the complete circuit of the track to go. Jane Austin, despite a couple of mistakes, is still the leader. By two lengths to Tangled in second. Control Freak is third. Hot Springs Unknown is fourth. Then comes Dark and Tribulation and Military Salute. To keep you complaining in the pink and black of Hollywood Hinton, just the back marker, but no more than 10 or 12 lengths off the leader. And that leader is still Jane Austin. Leading by two lengths. Tangled in second. Control for is third. As they get over number eight. We'll safely over number eight. She's got a mile left to race now. Jane Austen was over nine in the lead. From Tangled in second. Gap of four or five lengths back to the rest of them were headed by Dark and Tribulation. That's Jane Austen and Tangled disputing the lead then. Well clear of Dark and Tribulation and Control Freak. And then Hot Springs Unknown and Military Salute to keep it complaining. He's just beginning to drop off the back. As they head down towards flight number 10. And Tangled might have just poked her nose in front as they get over that one from Jane Austin. Jane Austin's gone back on there with a slightly better jump. The Packer beginning to close on the leading pair. I've got three more to get over, and it's Jane Austin who's driven into this fourth last, actually, in the lead and gets away from it well and has now opened up my crop and then it's tangled suddenly, caught a bit one pace. Military salute is now making ground in third. Control freak is after that one. Then comes Dark and Tribulation. They've still got three flights to get over, and Jane Austin's kicked on for home. Tangled is still there in second. Military salute is third. Control freak on the inside four. Then comes Dark and Tribulation. Gap back to Hot Springs Unknown. Tickety complaining is out of it. They're racing down to the third. 
third last and Jane Austen gets over it nicely in the lead four lengths clear and going well from Tangled in second military salute is third but it's still this Jane Austen who races towards the second last flight with a clear lead of four lengths Jane Austen gets over the second last jumped it really well Tangled jumped it well in second and is starting to make some ground on the leader but Jane Austen looks clear she races towards the final fight in there with a lead of a good three lengths Tangled is trying to close in second military salute is still running on well in third as well they come down to this final flight it could all come down to the jump Jane Austen is in the lead Tangled is beginning to close the gap it's Jane Austen in front over the final flight Tangled jumps it quicker he's beginning to close it's Jane Austen on the inside Tangled on the outside Jane Austen's got to hang on and take it Jane Austen wins it Tangled second the pair of them well clear of Hot Springs and now in dark and tribulation and military salute after that and Jane Austen hangs on to take it for David Robertson, the winner. Tangled second for Martin Leedham. Hot Springs unknown for Vinnie Gerard was third. Dark and Tribulation James Shea was fourth. And Military Salute for Jim Murray was fifth. That's me done for day one. I'll pass you over to Graves at Worcester, I think, for the final three races of the opening day.